so I'm out in southeastern Wisconsin today, and the whole goal is to show you guys the new product from Uncle Josh. It's called Meat. And so I've got my AquaView set up, and I'm, I found a weed bed. And I'm just sitting here jigging the meat and trying to catch some bluegills. There's one. There's some crappies down here too, but... There's... Oh, dropped it. There's a gill right there. I mean, that's a nice size. What a seven-incher. And that was right away on the drop. The second I got that camera rolling. There we go. It's a nice bluegill on the meat right there. Kind of hard to see in the shack, but it's a good fish. That's a tiny bluegill. You can see he's holding on to it, not even spitting it out. Well, of course I say that and then he does, but how long do you expect a bluegill to hold on to it if you don't hook set? So if I wasn't trying to film this, what I would do is drop to the bottom and then slowly jig up. I'm out today just showing you guys the action of the Uncle Josh meat. It's a great alternative to live bait. It stays on the hook. Um, it's got live bait scents and oils on it and fish just love it. Uh, I've got the meat leech. It's a two inch piece and I've actually pinched it in half so I've got a piece on right now. It's about the size of a, uh, a wax worm and that's what you're looking at right now. Um, if, if when you pinch it in half you can also have a spike size piece and I just decided to try the bigger one right now. Um, usually I fish with the uh, smaller size, but I thought it'd show up better on camera. 